I wanted to show you today how to read one of Sherry's ebooks on your PC. Now, first of all, you're going to end up with an email coming to you, and it'll talk to you about your EPUB purchase, just as the email you see on here. And you'll see a link in here, and uh, don't click on the link yet. First of all, what we want to do is make sure that we have some e-reader software on your PC. And you can see down here, I've got various instructions here on how to do this. But what you want to do is uh, pick one of the ones like the Adobe uh, Digital Editions uh, e-reader, and that's different than a PDF reader, or uh, the, the Caliber one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the Caliber one here. And you'll see it brings up my Internet Explorer and the caliber page uh, comes up okay and over here it says download so i'll click on the download and of course uh, we want to download the windows version so i'll click on windows and uh, we'll uh, we'll click here on download uh, caliber and it'll ask if we want to save it or if we want to run it. So I'm going to run it, and it's uh, not particularly uh, too large, but it will take uh, a few minutes to download. So I'm back now, and uh, Caliber's almost finished uh, downloading. Just has a few seconds left here to go. And you can see it's now asking us uh, for the license. So you can uh, read through the license there and uh, accept it with the checkbox here and click the install button. So that will uh, again take uh, a few minutes while it uh, installs on your, uh, on your computer uh, depending on the speed of your, uh, your Windows PC. And we'll tell it we want to start Caliber. So what it will do is it will bring up the welcome screen. And uh, you can tell it all sorts of types of books you want to read and things like that. But basically, uh, all you do is want to start it. Uh, we now can go back to the email. And we can click on the link here that, uh, that tells us uh, to, to do the download uh, for, the, uh, for the product. And it will again uh, bring up Internet Explorer for us. And you can see here, it will uh, give us a link to click on, the orange link here. Uh, we click on that to, to download our ebook. And it'll ask us if we want to open it or if we'd like to, to save it. Now, I usually like to save these initially just so I know where they're going. If you're using another browser like Firefox or uh, Chrome, it'll probably put it in your downloads. But it's always good to know where it's going. So here where it says save, I'm going to click on that and I'm going to put save as. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here and put it on my desktop so I know I'll be able to find it without any problem. So what it's doing now is it's uh, downloading it and you can see it's, uh, it's completed. So now that it's finished uh, and depending on the size of the book and the speed of your internet link that may take a few minutes or it may be uh, relatively quick. And once it's finished downloading uh, we can go over here to Caliber by clicking on the bottom or up here on the program itself and we can click on Add Books. And again, we'll go back up to our desktop and you can see here that the Tangled Garden Whimsies is the last one that's come in and we can click on that and open it up.
And what it's doing now is it's adding it to the library. And once it's added to the library, we can just simply double click on it and it will start to open up the ebook. We can resize it if we like to see it a little larger. And we can use the arrows to flip through the different pages of the ebooks. We can do that with the down arrow to make sure we get all the pages. And you can see the sliders here to assure you're not missing anything.